All right, we got a small delivery today. Well, maybe not quite so small. That's what 32, <laughs> that's what 32 550 watt uh, solar panels come in. And this is all the rest of it from Sun Gold Power. Let's open it up, see what we got. Man, the packaging looks great. They ship them via FedEx. That all looks pretty good. And then, like I said, this is the, uh, I mean, that's a metal, that's a, I mean, that's a solid wood. Fragile, must be French. I mean, look at the size of that piece of wood there. That's just a trim, but yeah, that's, that's pretty good uh, packaging. Wow. It's pretty impressive packaging here. This is where the, the charger's in. I mean, that's, that's pretty impressive packaging. Okay, you got the lid of this thing open. It's pretty good shipping. Um, there was another box in there that had the remote um, stuff on it. Pretty good shipping. Okay, so the inverter is basically 29 inches tall. Well, 29 when you add the stuff down there at the bottom. 29, 30 inches, okay. And 17 inches wide. So I took and I mounted just a scrap piece of 2x4 here on the wall, leveled it out. That is 40 inches from the top. So it's going to give me a 10 inch of clearance there. So the bottom of it, yeah, there's 40 inches. So that's would be, I don't know why I put that mark there. 33, I don't know why I put that mark there, but there's 40 inches. So the, the bottom of the inverter will sit on that and I'll mount it on that wall. Then of course it's 17 inches wide. So I found the middle of my board here. Middle's right here, that mark. And it's 17 inches wide, so eight and a half inches, that'll be the right side, the right edge. Okay, so uh, when they say that that thing's heavy, yeah, no shit, it's heavy. That's the 1800 or 18,000 kilowatt hours, but it, man, it is heavy. You have to figure out how we can lift it up that high. It's heavy. Alrighty, guys, it's up on the wall. Let me tell you, that's the Sun Gold Power 18,000, and it is heavy. Five grown men. We took all of these melt cartons and stacked basically staircases up to it, lifted it, and it was all we could do, five guys, to lift that sucker up there. And I had this board underneath it to basically less rest it on while we put it up there. But man, it is it is heavy. And we also took put some rope up across the trusses up there and took these straps. And as we went up, we pulled the straps, put some rope, some mule tape right here in these top two things here. I can actually see a piece of, of the mule tape there. We doubled up the mule tape, hooked it so we can pull it up and have something just to sturdy it. And then once we started lifting, I said, okay, it's up there. I'm going to put more lags. I put some three-inch lags up there in the top of that plywood behind the firewall. Um, just because of, fuck, this son of a bitch is heavy. It says it's 200 pounds, but man, it is all in the top. And it, oh. Anyway, guys, so it's up there. Um, so now I'll do some drilling. And, well, first off, I'm going to drink some beer with my buddies to help me lift it and the next thing i'll do and not today but tomorrow start running out of the main panel into it and then out of the out of it into the sub panel we're moving 